Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. Today's Friday and I actually went for a run this morning with Trooper, which was the first time that I've ever done that. We take Trooper on walks all the time and I will do like a little jog with him, but I've never tried to actually like go on my morning run with him and he did so, so good. So I'm really excited about that. I posted about it on Instagram and a few people DM'd me like with the concern that the pavement might be too hot, but don't worry, I'm well aware of that. I live in the state of Florida where it's like so freaking hot out so I always feel the pavement beforehand and I will only ever take him if it's early in the morning or later in the evening when the pavement is safe for their little paws because I do not want his paws getting burned but I took a shower and I just put my makeup on which is obviously way too dark for my skin right now because I haven't self tanned in like over a week I might self tan tonight I just have to figure out when I'm shooting content again I like to be tan for the photos but I have my hair wrapped up in this turban and I thought I would film my first impressions of the Revlon one step hair dryer that I got yesterday at Target I'm really looking forward to trying it and I hope that it works as well as everyone says wow this is like really a lot bigger than I was expecting I thought it was going to be like the size of a hairbrush and it's like massive impressions I really really like it it's definitely like a little bit of a learning curve it's a lot different than like a normal blow dryer because you're like brushing your hair with it but it definitely gives me that like salon feel because you know when you like go to the hair salon and they like blow dry your hair and they have like the brush up to it and they like spin it as they go like it definitely gives me that salon feel one reason why I don't typically blow dry my hair a lot and I like shower at night just so my hair dries overnight is because whenever I blow dry my hair my hair gets really frizzy but as you can see it's not super frizzy and it kind of almost looks like I just straightened it um, because like I'm brushing it the whole time so I like it. it dried my hair really nicely my hair feels soft and sleek and I honestly feel like I could just like leave it like this and not even have to style it if I didn't want to whereas usually if I like used a blow dryer on my hair I would absolutely have to style it afterwards because it would just be crazy so I like it. I think I'm going to keep it. We're going to give it a few more tries and see how it goes, but it's pretty cool. It has like a cool setting and a low setting and a high setting. I used it on the high setting because my hair takes literally forever to dry. And then in case anyone's wondering, this is the hair turban that I use. I talked about this a long time ago. I had it in white. This brand, you can get it at Sephora and I'll link it in the description. They come in a bunch of colors. I did have the white one, but it started to get discolored after I had my hair color. Like it would just start to come off in it. So I got the black one and I really like the black one. Just got dressed in my comfy little lounge outfit because I'm just going to be working on stuff for the store today. I have some orders to pack and then I have a bunch of things that I need to tag. Um, but I wanted to do a little outfit of the day. I will link these sweat shorts. They're the comfiest thing. I actually have them in a couple of different colors. And you can totally tell I'm not wearing a bra right now. But I don't really care honestly because I'm not leaving the house today. So I didn't feel like putting one on. But this is the Stella crop top from my store. And it's just like got that one shoulder design. It was in black on the store. And I am restocking it in black. But it's also going to be coming out in this really pretty tan color. Which I'm obsessed with. It looks really pretty with white. My earrings are also from some bunny they're the twisted gold hoops I love these so much they've become like my everyday earring I love how lightweight they are and they're like really big so they definitely like draw some attention I've been getting lots of questions about where my lightning bolt necklace is from and this is also from Sun Bunny it's coming on the next drop it's 14 karat gold dipped and this one is as well but they don't actually come together so this is just a necklace by itself and so is this one I just like layering them because I think it looks pretty I just got a couple of packages in from Lily Lemon and I'm so excited excited so you guys know I love Lululemon Align leggings they're like my favorite they're the most comfortable thing in the world I love just wearing them around the house because they just feel like so buttery soft um so Lululemon came out with biker shorts in their Align material so I jumped on that so fast so I just got a classic pair of 
biker shorts in the align material and these are 10 inches and they are the super high rises so i'm so excited i just love the material of these they're super super comfortable and biker shorts are like my new favorite and then they also came out with a new energy bra so i love the energy bra i have three of them two of the black long line energy bras and then i have one of the white but then this is another new thing they just came out with the long line energy bra in a high neck design so the normal one like dips down to like about here and this one goes up pretty high so i think this would be really nice for when i'm running because i don't have to worry about you know yeah and of course i love the crisscross on the energy bra super comfortable i'm so glad they came out with this like long one because i have the ebb train to be bra and it's like one of my favorites because of that high neck design so i'm so glad they decided to do the high neck in the energy line so yeah that's all i got from lululemon i can't wait to pair these together i feel like this will be so cute to go take a run in i really want to go back to the gym i know a lot of my friends are like going back to the gym and stuff i just i don't know how i feel about it yet i feel like i just don't know if it's safe but I really do miss the gym. I just tried on the new set from Lululemon I wanna show you guys. Okay, these Align leggings are so comfortable. They are super, super high rise. My belly button's down here and they come way up, which I love because then I can just wear it with a sports bra and be comfortable. I don't like when my leggings are like really low and there's like a bunch showing here, then I can't just like wear a sports bra with it. And you can see the sports bra is long line, so it does come down pretty far and it's high neck, which I love. This is so cute. Definitely one of my favorite things that I've bought in a while from Lululemon. Chad picked up Chick-fil-A for us for lunch and I just got a salad, just a side salad because I'm not super, super hungry. And then I also just added chicken to it and it came with these to put on top. They forgot to give me my salad dressing so we're just going to eat it plain. way later now i was recording and my camera literally was like messing up so bad i thought it was broke i was like in the middle of tagging items for the next drop and i was gonna just like get a montage clip like i always do and then um all of a sudden my camera went like really dark and there was like a line on it so i cleaned the lens and it wasn't coming out so i started freaking out chad was like we'll take the lens off and see if it's like in the inside of the lens and i was like no like it's broke and then I took it off and it was in the inside of the lens. So I cleaned it and we're good now, obviously. Um, but it is way later and I just got changed. Chad and I have to run up to Petco to get Trooper's dog food. And we figured while we're out, we're just going to get dinner while we're out. So we don't have to cook tonight. Here's my little date night look. I'm just wearing the same shirt that I was wearing earlier. And then these mom jeans that are from Topshop. I'll link them. They're super comfortable and they fit me really well. And then I'm just wearing these little nude heels that are from Target. Oh yeah, and this cardigan because I always get super cold whenever we go out to eat. Uh, and the cardigan is like super old. Like I think it's like three years old from Abercrombie. The storm is a brewing. Behind. Ah! So scary. We just saw some really brutal lighting, so I'm trying to... What was it? Light... <laughs> Lightning. <laughs> Not lighting. <laughs> this chandelier was really brutal. <laughs> Some brutal lighting. <laughs> okay, well. Yeah, I'm glad you called me out on it so that way someone doesn't call me out in the comments like, wow, she's so stupid. She doesn't even know the difference between lighting and lightning. Oh! Why is she wearing a mask in her car? The haunted light post probably got struck by lighting <laughs> chad don't worry i'll always laugh at your corny jokes <laughs> Our little date night getting dinner 
we haven't done that in a while like we just obviously with covid we like don't go out to eat like we used to which is good i guess because we're saving money but at the same time i just like miss having those date nights and i had two texas sweet teas we went to cheddar's if you're familiar with that and their texas sweet teas are so strong they literally have like a limit of two because you know they're strong it was so good i got like such a, a good buzz going but when we got home i was just in like the goofiest mood i was like giving chad a massage and just being so goofy about it but i'm actually on my way to the gym right now which i am so freaking excited about because i told you guys i have not been to the gym since like march beginning of march and i wasn't planning on going um but a friend of mine who actually was in my chem class as a personal trainer and back during the spring semester in chem one he asked me if i wanted to come to the gym and like try out personal training and i really wanted to do it but then the whole covid thing happened and gyms got shut down so long story short he asked if i wanted to come now um i've been getting emails from the gyms all the time about like all of their safety precautions and how like you know it's safe and i know there's not a lot of people going because of that reason so I just thought I'd go today and just check it out. I think it's worth checking out because I know that they're taking a lot of precautions and I really want to get back into the gym. And I'm excited to work out with a personal trainer today because um, I don't know if I'm going to like continue doing this. I doubt that I will, but it's always fun to like work out with a trainer that can like tell you what to do and keep that momentum going because I feel like I don't push myself as hard when I'm just working out myself. Filled up my Hydro Flask. I haven't even had any coffee yet this morning. I just decided I'm going to wait until afterwards and maybe stop at Starbucks as like a little treat after my workout. But most likely we're going to work out legs. We haven't officially talked about it, but because I've just been running all the time and I haven't like had a good solid leg day in a while i think that's what i'd like to focus on so i know it's gonna be rough for me and just finished my workout dang i forgot how much i miss going to the gym guys it was so good i just feel like i am so out of shape because i don't ever do any like of those kind of things anymore i just run and i do like very simple like circuits and like hit workouts in the garage i never really do like the weight training and you know use just like gym equipment anymore so it kicked my butt but it was really good and i burned over 300 calories which you guys know if you know me it takes so much for me to like get to 300 calories i literally feel like i have to work out forever and it was super good I just got out of the shower and I'm about to self tan. I just shaved everything and exfoliated and I normally would not be about to self tan in the middle of a Saturday, but I really need to shoot some content for somebody. Our next drop is actually gonna be this Wednesday. I definitely knew I didn't wanna do it on Friday next week, but I wasn't sure if I was gonna do like Tuesday or Wednesday. So I am doing Wednesday, which means I need to be tan cause I have to shoot content. So I'm going to tan with this. I love how I go to the gym today and then Chad's like, ooh, I want Chinese for dinner. So here I am eating Chinese food. But you know what? Sometimes you just gotta live a little. Don't mind what I look like right now. I just finished self tanning, Chad did my back, and I'm about to write my to-do list for tomorrow, and then Chad and I are gonna watch our show, Blacklist, and then I'm gonna go to bed. So I think I'm gonna end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button, and I'll see you in my next video.